Greetings and salutations, dear one. Today is Tuesday, December 12th, 2023. Today's color is red, and it's a new moon in the sign of Sagittarius. This is Eric for Tarot Talks. You have questions, I have answers. Be sure you save, share, like, and follow. Comment below. Let us shuffle the cards. We have now unlocked the secrets of the Deck of Answers by Eric. That's me. If you would like to get your own Deck of Answers, I invite you to visit my profile and there you can access how to book a session with me and how to get your hands on my products that I've designed specifically for you to bring magic into your life. I know, right? So exciting. I'm asking the universe and my higher self for direction and for guidance for the message that you need today. And remember, life's lessons are your life's lessons. You can wake up every rising and just choose to live your life how you choose to, but I go on here and I create these videos for you because sometimes you need that extra reminder or that confirmation that you are on the right track. I'm gonna be pulling four cards for you today. Four cards, I want balance, two and two. There's so many different ways to read cards. You really will have to find your own technique and your own method. That's really what's going to help you along your journey. So I've got Dreamer, Blonde Hair, Family, and Music of Spheres. This is telling me right now that you are dreaming of White Christmas. You are dreaming of creating. You are dreaming of family. You are dreaming of making a connection. This is a time right now where you need to make your list, check it twice. I know this sounds just... It's more about the holiday. I'm, I'm really getting more Christmas vibes with this reading. Pulling the card from the top, Courage and Valor. Yet again, we had this card yesterday. Repito. This is telling you right now to just nestle in it to the hearth and the home. Your overall culminating card. Green Eyes. And your Carousel card is Foodie. Putting it all together, my message for you today, dear one, is to focus on yourself. Focus on clearing out the old debris. Clean your house. Don't forget to look up. That's the most important message today is don't forget to look up. Look up at your ceiling. Clean your house. Look up at the sky, of course. Check out the stars. Be open-hearted, open-spirited, and open-minded, of course, by all means. But now is a time for you to really look up. Look upstairs, look in your attic, look in your mind. Check out all the areas that need dusting and clean those areas out. If you need a trim, get yourself a trim, get your nails, your hair, do whatever makes you feel clean, supreme, prim and proper. Do whatever works for you to make you feel like you again. The family card, this is a time for you to really, really cherish your family. You really just need to come together with your family. Enjoy these times with your family. Whatever has gone on in the past, whatever narratives have maybe contributed to your conversations and your family, this is a time for you to now take accountability for your own energy, your own thoughts, your own action, and be a lighthouse for the rest of the world around you. Be that love, receive that love and give that love. Love is one of those awesome energies, feelings, vibrations. It's just a noun, it really is. It's a noun in all of its way of being because it could be a person, it could be a place, it could be a thing. Love is just everywhere. So right now love is abound. The music of the spheres. This card here is telling me to tell you that you need to make a connection. You need to connect more with your family, with yourself. Forgive yourself, forgive your family. Look at that, it's literally the cycle, the spiral of life. So from your beginning to your now, you need to make amends. Now is a time for you to truly embrace forgiveness and embrace who you are as a beautiful light being on this planet. The green eyes card as your culminating card. This card tells me that you need to heal the parts of you that you have put away. If your emotions were a piece of clothing, you have folded this t-shirt and kept it underneath all of the heaviest sweaters in your drawer at the very bottom drawer where all you put your junk stuff to. You need to take it out. Shake it out, throw it out, and move forward. You don't have to keep that pain. You don't have to keep that trauma. You really don't. But it's almost like you're guarded. You're cleaning your house, hoping for no more drama to come back in. It's almost like cleaning the cobweb spring for none to reappear. Well, you have to keep cleaning. You have to keep active. 
creative, just with exercising, just with everything, you have to keep on it. You have to be consistent. You have to put in the time, the effort, and the energy and everything that you do. So my message for you today is to keep dreaming, keep cleaning, keep loving, and keep connecting. And your carousel card, the foodie card. The foodie card is telling me this is the finer things in life card. I took this picture, by the way, when I was working at a restaurant. This is a charcuterie board. This tells you to focus on celebrating yourself. Enjoy the finer things in life. Enjoy your life in general. Enjoy the people around you. Enjoy your community. Enjoy everything that you do. Enjoy the sweets of life. Enjoy what life gives you. This whole experience that you're here for, you're here to create, you're here to dream. Contemplate everything that you need to. You know, think about it. You're a dreamer and you're creating and you have the ability to go out there and create. Just remove your guard, open your gate. That's what it is, you have to open your gate. You have to unlock. Surrender to love. If you're afraid of getting hurt, you're only afraid of getting hurt because you don't trust yourself. When you are with someone, be it a relationship, be it a friendship, there's trust. You trust in yourself to make the right decisions you have to trust in love don't walk around so guarded and protected the world is here for you and you are here for the world it's very mutual be one with love dear one be one with light i'm here for you monday through friday visit my profile if you'd like to book a one-on-one -on -one with me i'm here for you until tomorrow this is eric with tarot talks